Hey guys, it's Allie from the blog Hand Gathered Home. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how I decorated my porch for Christmas on a budget. So let's jump into it. So this um, porch makeover was super simple. I tried to keep it really minimal, kind of symmetrical, just really simple and budget friendly. Um, first, as you can tell, I am sweeping off um, the porch. One thing I love to do is layer these rugs on the front porch because it just adds more style. Also just kind of makes this space look bigger than it is versus just having a little tiny mat that is just, you know, two by three, super tiny. So um, I grabbed these trees from Walmart. I was looking for real trees because that was kind of the the goal in my head that was what I was envisioning but I could not find any that weren't like $30 each so I got these two pre-lit outdoor trees for $25 for the pair and I actually painted the little base because I didn't like the gold uh, it was kind of like a black with like gold paint smeared on it I did add some rocks in there so they don't fall over but I added them on top of these crates and then I just took cuttings from my Christmas tree and stuck them in these cute pots that I got from Goodwill for $5 each and I like the way that turned out so in a perfect world I would have loved for my trees to be real as well because that's kind of the look I wanted and kind of the look I like the more authentic feel but sometimes what I've learned is that when you're decorating on a budget sometimes you have to um, compromise a tiny bit for the time being to work towards what you want just know if your house is, and your projects are not perfect don't stress it because it's okay. You'll get there, you'll learn as you go, each year you'll learn, and I think that's the most important thing. I found these cute like lit trees in the little pots at Walmart. It was $25 for a pair which I thought was pretty good. I had bought these little black pots that you see um, lower down. They're like heavy and sturdy. I bought those at Goodwill the other day, hoping to stick trees in those, but I went around looking for real trees and I just could not find any that were affordable. Um, every little tree that I found was like $30 each and that just was not in my budget. So I ended up just taking Christmas tree cuttings and using those in the Goodwill pots and I think I'm happy with the way that looks. And then um, I'm hoping to get a little more firewood for the other side, but I grabbed what we had for the left side, which is not much as you can tell, but um, I'm really uh, happy with the way it turned out considering it was super affordable. A lot of it I already had and um, I just wanted something that felt more festive. Uh, this wreath was actually a $7.99 Goodwill find from, I want to say it was last year. I found it kind of at the end of the season and it just looks like really expensive and um, kind of there's variation in the different greens and so I think that makes it look a lot higher end than just the cheap uh, fake looking greenery. I'm really happy with the way it turned out. Um, there probably would be some things that I would do differently in the future, but um, I feel like every year I'm learning kind of what I like and what I gravitate towards. So it's all a learning process. So if you get to the end of your project and you just think like, oh, I just don't love it. Don't give up, don't get discouraged because you're learning. You're um, figuring out what you like and what sticks out to you and what is pretty to you and what your style is and I feel like I'm still learning that as well so if you're new here I would love it if you would subscribe and hit the bell while you're at it so you're notified every time I post a new video you can expect new videos twice a week on DIY simple living and making a house into a home on a budget I hope you found this helpful and I hope you realize that it doesn't have to take a lot of money or time or effort to decorate your front porch for Christmas thank you so much for watching we'll see you guys next time <laughs>